Hello, hope you are doing good. I'm your host Jason. In this video, I will be showing you how to make music automatically play on Google Sites. The first thing you want to do, once on Google Sites, you are going to either select the site that you would like to add it to, or you can select a template and you can create your website. So for example, let's say we were to select this random template. After you have done that, what I want you to do next is open a new tab on your browser and you are going to type in elfsite.com. After you have done that, you are going to go over to the top left hand corner and you are going to hover over widgets. After hovering over widgets, I want you to scroll down until you see audio and you are going to select background music. After selecting background music, you will be redirected to a new page. And from here, you can go over to the left hand menu option and you can select from any one of these templates. As you can see right here, there are numerous templates you can choose from. Whether you'd like to use this template or you'd like to use this one, you can select the option. After you're finished, you're going to tap on continue with this template. Then from here, you can tap on add track and you will be able to upload a track from your device. And you can also see that they have provided us with some copyright free images that we are better yet some copyright free audio that we can use. To remove these tracks, you could simply tap on the three dots and delete them and upload your own audio. You can also go over to the left hand menu option and you can select layout. So you can select whether you'd like it to be floating or embed. We'll be using embed. You're also going to tap on the player from the left hand menu option. And from here you can decide whether you like it to be shuffle, loop. You can tap on loop right there. And since we want it to auto play, we are going to scroll down and we are going to be toggling on auto play. Keep in mind that the autoplay feature requires the user's first action on the site. So for example, once they open the tab, if they click on your website, it will automatically start playing. You can also add a message or so on if you want. And to further customize it, you can tap on style. And then from there, if you would like to add a background image or so on, you can do that. If you would like to change it to dark mode, you can do that as you can see right here. It is completely customizable. After doing this, you are going to tap on add to site for free. Once you have tapped on add to site for free, you will be redirected to this dashboard. And from here, you can create an account using your Google login or Facebook or continue with email. So I'm going to log in real quick. Once you're logged in, you'll be redirected to this page. Then from here, you're going to tap on publish in the top right hand corner. After tapping on publish, you will see this page pop up and I want you to simply select the free plan. So you're going to tap right there to select the free plan. After you have selected the free plan, all you'll need to do now is copy the code. After you have copied the code, you're going to go into Google Sites. Then you are going to tap on embed from the right hand menu option and you are going to select embed code. After selecting embed code, you are going to paste the code that you have copied right here and you are going to tap on next. Then from there, you are going to tap on insert. After tapping on insert, you can see that we have now added the audio player and all you need to do now is tap on publish and that's it. Hope you found this video helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.